being the starting quarterback of the New England Patriots. Mac Daddy, Mac and Cheese, the Joker, Maxonville, whatever the nickname that John o. Smith, Cam Newton, or his Alabama teammates have come up with. He is now the starting quarterback for the New England Patriots. Was this a good move or a bad move? I could tell you right now, for the fantasy football community that has any sort of New England Patriots player, you're saying, oh my gosh, thank goodness. This is so great. Mac Jones is a starting quarterback. My receivers, my tight ends, and my running backs even are going to get much more work. Cam Newton is not going to be a touchdown vulture, vulture at the goal line. And Damian Harris, Ramondre Stevenson, maybe even deeper league J.J. Taylor is going to get those touchdowns. Jacoby Myers is going to benefit as a number one receiver. John o. Smith and Hunter Henry are going to be great tight ends as well. So we know for, as far as stats go for the New England Patriots and for fantasy football, this is a very good move. As far as winning football games, let's break this down. Let's talk about Mac Jones and how he has been doing as the Patriots starting quarterback, or at least playing in the preseason, uh, in the 2021 preseason. 36 out of 52 of his passes completed. That is 69% nice of his passes completed. 390 yards, uh, seven and a half passes or yards per attempt. One touchdown, zero interceptions, a 97.3 quarterback rating, and a 92.2 pro football focus rating, leading all rookie quarterbacks. Those numbers are freaking fantastic for a rookie quarterback. Now, granted, a lot of that came against some second-team players, third-team players as well. Uh, I believe he played some first-team players as well. But I think that Mac Jones, for the just looking at the stats and itself and watching him play during preseason, it's safe to say that, yes, you can have a lot of confidence in Mac Jones as a Patriots starting quarterback. As a matter of fact, even though he threw one touchdown, it should have been two touchdowns. Uh, there was a pass towards the end zone that was just completely perfect with a nice rainbow arc falling right into the receiver's hands. Did not make it. Did not complete it. But that was not Mac Jones' fault. So it should have been two touchdowns at that point. Cam Newton, on the other hand, looking at his preseason stats, 14 out of 21 of his passes completed. That is 66%. 162 yards, one touchdown, and one interception. Okay, so, you know, you can look at the stats and say, yeah, Mac Jones has had more playing time. They've been uh, keeping... Cam Newton healthy and, and, and really giving the time to Mac Jones so that Cam Newton can be healthy for the season. But you have to break it down in how everyone was doing during training camp as well. So Mac Jones has been looking fantastic. The Patriots do not regret the decision at all to take him at number 15 overall. Cam Newton, according to Rob Nikovich, the former Patriots linebacker, has been struggling in camp. As a matter of fact, according to him, and he's a reliable source, he has connections to the New England Patriots, he says that Cam Newton was struggling to learn the playbook and training camp, and Mac Jones had to teach him. The rookie had to teach the veteran the playbook. Now, I know Cam has only been in the, in the Patriots offense for one year, but that already is a pretty bad sign that your rookie quarterback has to give you pointers and, and teach you uh, and give you some clarity about the playbook. Uh, I still think Cam Newton can, can play and We'll see where else he can go. But as far as the Patriots go, I personally think it was a great decision on the Patriots' end. This is There's no better time than now to start with Mac Jones. And it's statistically proven, I've said this many times on the show, that it, once a rookie quarterback starts right out the gate, starts week one, starts week four, just early on in his rookie season, his second year, he's going to be fantastic. And it's going to be great development. For his career. So forget that sitting and, and waiting and learning. Yeah, you learn some stuff, but nobody knows what they're talking about when they say, oh, you, you, your rookie quarterback should sit behind the veteran and learn. No, that statistically proves not to be true. First round quarterbacks that start right out the gate are proven statistically to have a better career than quarterbacks that sit and learn. Aaron Rodgers is like the only example. Patrick Mahomes as well. Yeah, those guys are outliers, but if you start rookie quarterbacks out the gate, they are going to perform so well in the future, and I'm excited about Mac Jones. So, in conclusion, we could say that uh, this is better for the Patriots, for the Patriots pass catchers at least, for the Patriots running backs as well. Uh, we project Mac Jones to finish second in the NFL in completion percentage, just behind Teddy Bridgewater. And up there as well as Patrick Mahomes and Derek Carr, I think, on our projections as well. Uh, 
you're going to get the money's worth out of the Patriots signings. You sign these big players, Johnny Smith, Hunter Henry, all these players to this big, enormous amount of money. But if it wasn't worth it with Cam Newton not really passing it that much, was it really worth it in the end? Right now, it's proving that it can. I bet they're very happy that the 49ers passed on them at number three because the 49ers were really big on Mac Jones. And they, for a second, thought that they were going to pick Mac Jones and trade it up at number three to pick him. And then they really thought about it, and they're like, no, maybe Trey Lance is the guy. And I think the Patriots, the fact that they didn't have to trade up to number 15, and they got Mac Jones at 15, beautiful. Beautiful scenario for the Patriots. So I like Mac Jones. Leave your thoughts in the chat. Do you think that Mac Jones is going to be better than Cam Newton? And what's your prediction record? Or what's your record prediction for the New England Patriots? Leave your comments and let us know.